Yo, what's going on, guys? Danger's back with some more Mutt 16 as we are winding down to the end of Mutt for Madden 16 and on our way to Madden 17. I figured why not throw back a little bit because I haven't done this in a little bit or in a minute, I would say. Uh, budget Squad. We're back with the Budget Squad. God, the grind for this squad is tough because I have four contracts or six contracts. My bad, those are my tickets. I have six contracts and look at all my players low on contracts and I have 3600 coins I'm supposed to be spending on players man I'm gonna have to transfer over some coins and buy some uh, buy some contracts but anyway that was the offense this is the defense figured I'd show you guys the team I know I have it in my past couple videos um, because I have been using the same squad but since we're using a different one figured I'd show you the team so there's the team hope you guys enjoyed that so let's go ahead and get into the game going against the Rams alright so I was thinking for this video I wasn't really sure what to really talk about, so I was actually trying to make videos earlier, but really, computer, you're gonna you're gonna fuck me over right here and just have a loud ass fucking noise. Okay, I see how it is, I see how it is. But I wasn't really sure what to talk about for this video because I was gonna try to talk about like a topic or something. And really nothing is going on, and I refuse to get into the fucking YouTube drama situation. We'll not even go into that. Fuck that, dude. That's so no. Not not even gonna say anything about it. But Let's see, this guy's got Cutler and Steven Jackson. I don't think I've ever seen that combination before. But uh, I'd say the end of Madden 16. Now, my verdict on Madden 16 for the year is pretty good. It was pretty good. It was pretty fun. I ended up actually experimenting on Xbox One. What the fuck? Steven Jackson, stop it. Stop being a tank. Um, I actually ended up experimenting on Xbox One. It was actually the console I was on at the beginning of the year. Because I actually got it last summer to play with my friends. Because, if you guys don't know, I switched from 360 to PS4, and all my friends got an Xbox One. So, I was, like, I was by myself. So, I got an Xbox One to play, and it sucked. As I user, oh my god, that was mean. And it's a pick six. Oh my god, wait, wait. Oh. Uh. <laughs> that was mean. That was mean. Why'd you throw that at me, dude? Everybody knows you don't throw at me. I'm being too cocky. Anyway. That's a great way to start. 7 nothing already. A pick six by Anthony Barr. User pick six. That, that was dope. Anyway, to uh, go ahead and talk about Madden 16, I'd say this game brought me a lot of happiness. I was very excited when I first got it because it was actually the first real Madden that I was super fucking hyped for. And, well, I mean, Madden 25, I went in halfway. I was uh, halfway through the year. I started playing Mutt. And then Madden 15, I was like, all right, I'm excited. I played it. As soon as it came out, like literally midnight that night, I started playing it. But, I don't know, I didn't really love Madden 15. It wasn't my favorite Madden, but it was definitely still good. But Madden 16, I'd say, wasn't an improvement. But, of course, the aggressive catch. The aggressive catch cheese is, uh, was, always, was always there for Madden 16. I've heard they resolved it for Madden 17. So, I was happy with this game. I was happy with it. And plus, it started out my career on YouTube, making good videos. Or making videos, you know, some people may not say they're good. But anyway, making videos from Madden 16 was where my YouTube channel started. And is where it is still going today. And going straight into Madden 17, I'm excited. I'm excited for Madden 17. Happy Gronk's on the cover. I mean, I would probably prefer Von Miller out of the three that were there. I know it was Antonio Brown. This guy trying to screenplay? Fuck no. It was Antonio Brown, Von Miller, and Rob Gronkowski. I'm actually a Gronkowski fan. I've always liked Gronk. But I feel like Von Miller was a little bit more deserving, I would say. Because Gronk was hurt, and Von Miller won the fucking Super Bowl. He won the Super Bowl MVP. I don't know. I, I, that's just my opinion. Um, people may not share my opinion, but you know, that's, that's the thing about opinions. Is that they're fucking opinions as we knock the ball out in the middle of the field for 4th and 11. He's 1 for 4 with an interception and a TD. Um, I got the TD, though. He threw the TD to me. I'm talking too much. Anyway, as it, I'm tired, actually. I'm tired. My sleep schedule is fucked right now. Well, it's not It's not bad, but I had a really... Whoa, shit, Dry Archer. I had a nap earlier today, and I slept for like four hours, and it's 11 o'clock right now. And I'm still tired. Like, I'm still fucking waking up from my nap. How do I wake up from a nap fucking six hours later? Like, are you kidding me? I'm fucking retarded. I'm so, I'm so bad with sleep, man. I've always had been. I'm terrible with sleep. Huh, man, I don't know. Anyway, boy, he is blitzing his ass off, and OBJ, do it to him. Oh, shit. I thought I'd get that back to you, because I guess I couldn't. I was also thinking about going back to cut cons, but if you guys 
have paid attention, and for everybody watching this video, you'll get the jump on this, but I was thinking about going back to cut comms for the rest of Madden 16, but like I said, the reason that I'm not doing cut comms right now is because that, you know, Madden 16 is the end of the year, so it's like, oh, that was a bad throw. He almost caught it, though. That fucking bounced off his hands. Why didn't he catch that? Anyway, the reason for me not doing cut comms right now is because Madden 16 is coming to an end. I don't really have a ton of motivation to play this game anyway, let alone spend fucking an hour editing a video that, for the most part, wouldn't really make a difference for me because I know Madden 16, again, is coming to a close, so it's not the most popular thing right now. As we're chucking it up, oh, that, I went way too far back. Fuck. All right, now, now I'm fucking up. I'm not paying attention. But uh, we'll not go back to cut comps for the rest of Madden 16. I might, who knows, I might do one or two, possibly. But I know Madden 17, depending on how the feedback is for these games, I might go back to it in Madden 17. Or I may just stick with these. Depends on what I see and how things go. This guy does not want to switch. I'm going to go for it. Fuck this. He's not switching to, like, make the tackle or anything. So I'm just going to go for it. Get free. Thank you. Oh, he caught it. Thank God. I thought he was going to drop that fucking Carlos Williams, man. I think that's the 82. That's the 82 one I have. The fucking um, team of the week one, I believe. It's pretty good. Pretty good. We got speed. We got speed and Coleman right there. Oh, shit. Breaking tackles. Um, if you guys did not check out the new sets, the um, draft sets, the NFL premier sets or whatever... You get, like, somebody's base card in Madden 17. You get, like, a 97 overall version of Mutt 16. The sets are, like, fucking impossible. Because, first of all... Oh, damn, TP. First of all, all the fucking cards, like, the elite NFL draft players, are pretty much extinct. There's, like, barely any of them. So, they're, like, 100k a pop. And I'm not doing that. And then the gold ones, even though they put them back in packs, they're, like, 10k a pop. So, you're probably gonna have to pay, like, 600k to even do the fucking set. Like, it's insane. It's it's gonna be it's a lot of coins, man. It's a lot of coins. Jesus, how the fuck did Carlos Williams even spin out of that? I should probably fucking pay attention. I'm getting too into talking right now. I shouldn't be. <sighs> Come on, dude. Let's get this fucking play going. I got places to go. I got people to see. The penitentiary ain't the place for me. That was bad. That was bad. That was fucking. Trying to talk Eminem wasn't able to do it. All right. There we go. OBJ in the end zone up 14 nothing. At the end of the... Is it the end of the first or is it the beginning of the second? End of the first. Terrell Pryor is an absolute legend. I'm kind of upset that unless they add a specific QB Terrell Pryor card in the game next year, probably not going to be any more Terrell Pryor on the squad, which sucks because he is a receiver. So if they put him in, in the game as a receiver, God knows I'm probably not going to use him as a receiver. Maybe early in the year, possibly. But definitely not going to be long term. So that kind of sucks. Unless, again, they do come out with like uh, more campus heroes early in the year and they throw out a Terrell Pryor, which would be awesome. That would be amazing because he'd be my QB for a long ass time. <sighs> but I'm hoping that they release a nice, like, Schefter Star Rising, so whatever the fuck they're going to call him this year, um, QB early in the year because I like to use those cards. You got nothing, dude. You got fucking nothing, dude. Come on. Just throw up my user, man. I need another pick. Make myself fucking feel better right now. Trying to make an entertaining video. God knows that people don't think I'm entertaining. Go over the middle. Go over the middle. Fuck, he did. Who was that? Is that Kevin White? Is he gonna hurry up? No, usually... Usually anybody that I play that hasn't got shit going gets one pass. Oh, it's Travis Benjamin. Ends up hurrying up, so I was just assuming. <sighs> It'll take forever to call their plays, I swear to fucking God. It's going empty backfield. Well, good thing I run quarters 99% of the time. What happened? Please don't tell me that was me. No, it wasn't. Good. First and 15. That doesn't work. When you try to, like, get somebody to jump off sides, it just, it doesn't work, man. It doesn't work. I've tried it, believe me. It just does not fucking work. Uncover Travis. Cover. Jesus. Nope. Nothing. Nothing, dude. 
Who is that? That's Steven Jackson fucking catching the ball. That dude's a fucking tank. Every time I go against him, Steven Jackson just runs over me. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't ran with him more. As he runs with him now, but he gets blown up. Let's get it. Oh, that was the hit of the century. Holy shit, me trying to set up titles over here. <laughs> I'm just joking. So, who are his receivers? He's got Jeremy Macklin, Travis Benjamin, and Mark. He's got a solid squad. Solid squadron. He's got nothing trying to lob it, and it's almost picked by Mark Barron, but he said he goes up and smacks it down with one hand. Dude, use two hands. Give me a pick. Come on. Need a little something, something. What are you doing now? Fourth and 13. You're going to go for it, of course. Well, I probably would go for it, too. Because he doesn't get the ball back at half, either, and he's down 14. This game, I'm not going to say it's over, but it's definitely he's not in a good spot. Oh, shit. I swear to God. Don't. No. Don't pick it, either. Yes. Let's go. At the 32-yard line. I'm going to go with the read option. And also, guys, I have been streaming. This isn't a stream game, but, I mean, obviously, I would have said it was a stream game. Well, maybe not. It would probably be in the title if it was a stream game. But I am going to be streaming a lot more. I'm planning to. I want to. That's definitely my plan. I want to stream Madden 17 when it first comes out. And I want to just stream and then record the games and then post them. And that those will be my videos. And basically, I want to become a full-time streamer is what I want to do. But, um, I don't know. I'll try to do it. Oh! Josh Cribs? Josh Cribs! Oh my god! What? You never do that. You literally don't do anything close to that. And you just... You just moss those guys. Oh my god. Josh Cribs don't do that. I got him to run after the catch. And he, he... He don't do that. I don't know why he did that. Josh Cribs! <laughs> Josh Cribs for the touchdown. Let's get it, man. Oh my god. That could not have ended any fucking better. 21-0. 2 minutes, 17 seconds left. Wow, that's awesome. That's awesome. So crazy ass catch by Josh Cribs. I wasn't even targeting him either. I just saw the out. I didn't even know that was him. To be honest, I just saw the out route and I saw one on one and cut outside through it was Josh Cribs. Oh, that's awesome. Nobody uses Josh Cribs. Nobody ever does, and for good reason. Um, well, for good reason for most people. For me, I like that he has all the looseness, agility, speed. He doesn't even have great speed, but all of his acceleration and everything just makes him a dominant force, and I always like using him. So, I don't know. Just kind of one of those players I like to use. And it's kind of fun to post on YouTube because nobody uses Josh Cribs. Whereas, like, you see big YouTubers, or just YouTubers in general, always have, like, a Calvin Johnson or something. Or Julio Jones. I just want to, like, be stray away from the pack a little bit. Oh, my God! I came back down to play that too. I thought I timed that perfectly, man. Seriously, I thought I came back down and fucking timed that shit, but I still think I should have got it. Damn, I got robbed right there. I didn't realize he has Jason Witten. No wonder his tight end seems so fucking slow. Look at him. He's got. Look at my fucking safety. Okay, 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 okay. I see how it is. Oh, <laughs> well, fuck. I just talked shit about Jason Witten. Then he just fucking mossed my safety or corner. Oh, that was, uh... That's Tart. It's Mr. Tart. Okay, I think it, it might be... Okay, okay. It might be time for me to, uh... Get out of quarters. <laughs> fuck. Oh, damn it. I didn't think he'd run. I didn't think he'd run. With a minute and 31 left, I thought he tried to force the pass. Which he did at first. I just did not expect the run. It was definitely a good play call. Ah. <sighs> What the fuck is up with my fan right now? I hope the fan doesn't come through. It shouldn't. If it does, I'm going to be a little bit upset. Alright, so 21 to 7, minute 28 left. Hopefully I can get down the field. Don't usually go in empty backfield, but I'm going to do it. It's funny, in Madden 15, I go in empty backfield all the time. And now I just don't. I mean, get... Corey Coleman open. I'm chucking it up. He's got him beat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Corey Coleman down to the 29 yard line. I I just love the speed on this dude. I love the speed on Corey Coleman. The dude's a fucking weapon. He doesn't even have good catching or catching traffic. He just, he just fucking does. He just does it, man. He just does. That's what makes sense. But that's what I'm tired. Wow. Fuck it. 
Oh, sh I tried to trunk Anthony Barr. That was not the wisest move I could have made. Let's see if I can get this tight end in route. Like, over to the corner. That could be possible. See, we got OBJ. We've only hit him once this game. I got two extra people blocking. I'm taking one-on-one. -on -one. No! I had him, too. I think he was going towards the corner. I don't think he was going to be able to actually play that. Fuck, I thought I think Barnes would have been wide open. Let's see if we can get him on this out route with OBJ. Nope. Nope, he's got hella pressure. Oh no. No! Dude, that is so fucking unlucky. Oh my god, I have the worst luck in the world. That was bad to run around, but I was trying to... <sighs> Goes from 21-0 to 21-14, just like that. Wow, man. Wow, I gotta say, this guy's got good pressure. He got good pressure. Fuck. No, oh, that was a guy away. Fuck. Oh, my God. That sucks. That that fucking sucks. I can't I can't say anything else. That just fucking sucks. I just got strip sacked at the end of the half, and I'm still stubborn, and I'm still gonna try to go for the fucking end zone. Look at him. He's trying to run the same fucking blitz, dude. Oh my god, that was picked. That was picked out of bounds. What the fuck is up with this guy's pressure? Yo, like for real. What the fuck? How is he able to blitz everybody, and I'm not able to get anybody open downfield? When I had Coleman, I waited too. I waited too long, and I got two extra people fucking blitzing. I need something. Need something. Look at this! What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Yo, like, look at this guy's fucking blitzes. This is ridiculous. I need like an out route or something. Where's an out route? Come on, I don't have a simple fucking out route in this playbook. I need a simple out route. I'm missing one on it. Where the fuck? This, that, that'll work, I guess. That's just a straight out route. I was looking for something like... A corner route is what I meant, not an out route. OBJ might be able to get this. I don't know. Fuck. Nope. Fucking of course not. As I get sacked. Oh my god, dude. Everything is just turned around. I can't do shit now. I knew this game was a fucking over. God damn it. Dude, there's a chance for him to fucking score right now. Very small, but he could still score. Seven seconds at the 43, two timeouts. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. Just fucking stop him. Don't let him get anything. Thank you. Dude, you... Fine. You know what? I probably would have done the same thing, but that's just annoying. Don't let him get the fucking ball off. Just don't let him, because I know Cutler can get this ball down there. And just don't let it happen, please. Yes. No. No, 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 no. That's actually going there. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Fuck, 21-14. We got the ball back. Fuck. I think I'm going to have to try to run the ball. I haven't really tried to run the ball this entire game because he keeps trying to blitz. But maybe that's just why I need to beat him is to run the ball. That was a nice juke by Archer right there. Sucks it didn't go for anything, but still a nice juke. All right. TP, I need you to break one right now. Got two... Fuck! This guy just won't... He's so relentless with this fucking blitz. It's ridiculous. Come on, man. Fuck! Something. I need fucking something. Like, what's getting open? What the fuck? Are you kidding me? How is this shit even fucking working? All this guy can do is fucking turbo blitz me. That's it. 
This guy's got nothing fucking else. That's it. Oh, I threaded the needle right there. Oh, good God. Oh, good God. Thank you, Josh. Dude, Josh Cribs, you are my savior. You are my fucking savior. I threaded the needle on that throw. That was really risky. Thank God, dude. I couldn't fucking handle any of that turbo blitz shit anymore. Fuck this guy. I'm overthinking everything. I'm like trying to think of it. Just simple shit will be this fucking blitz. Simple shit. A screen pass will be the. I don't know why I didn't fucking run a screen. A screen pass probably would have destroyed it. I'm retarded. That's why. Alright, so now all we need to do is hold this lead. Hold this lead and make him hold this L. That was really cheesy. Good God. Okay. So, I think he, he wants to run, I'm pretty sure, because he saw that he was able to break a run last time. I want to force him to throw still, but I want to let him know that I will fucking blitz. That was bad. I hit the wrong hole. That was really, really bad. Come on now. Run it, dude. He's got nothing, he's got nothing, he's got nothing. Yes! Let's get it, man! Whoo! Another pick. That's two. That's two, man. Thank you, I fucking needed that. Alright, so I'm not gonna fuck up. Where's the screen pass? There it is. Alright. There we go. No, what the fuck? Who's who's 61? Who is 61 on my team? He ran away. He said, fuck you, and ran past that dude that tackled me. I got two yards. I got two yards off of that shit. I should have got so much more. Oh, my God. Dude, TP, man. I need you to nail some of these throws, dude. Seriously. I have Gary Barnage open on the sidelines. I need you to nail that fucking throw. You can't just fucking throw it out of bounds like that, man. For fucking real. There you go. Leave Dry Archer open. That's a smart move. Nice job. Nice job. Great defense, bro. Great defense. Shouldn't say shit because he's been stopping me the entire goddamn game. But, you know, what? I'm going to anyway. <sighs> I'm going to try to run the ball. It's not going to work. Outside, outside, inside. That was a nice juke. Down to the 20, so 7 yards. 7 yards, 7 yards. I don't think a read option will work, but I'm going to see what he lines up in, and we'll see. Um, I don't know. I think that safety is going to get me, but fuck it. Yep, he did. That exact person I thought was going to get me got me. As he blitzed. Fucking A. This guy just will not stop the zone blitzing or just the blitzing in general. He won't stop. And I, honestly, why would he? I can't fucking stop it. Good thing I got OBJ. Let's get it, man. I saw him finally not cover that shit, and I'm like, I am going to that now. I'm actually having a pretty solid game with CP. 11 for 17, 243, 3 TDs. It's pretty damn good, actually. It doesn't feel like I'm doing that, but I am. Yes! Oh my god, I didn't think he'd catch that. Wow, down to the one. Let's punch this in, man. Let's punch this the fuck in. Give us a three score lead and make me happy. Come on, man, pick a play. It's the one fucking yard line. What could you be, like, trying to find right now? I didn't even get the first. That's funny. I got second in inches, so I could still get a first right here. Doesn't matter though. In for the touchdown, up by three. Three scores. Up by 21 though. 35 to 14. At the end of the third quarter, I'm happy. I'm happy. Alright. That's pretty much all I can say is I'm fucking happy. Now, the only thing I'm hoping that happens right now is that this video comes out. Because fucking Oh God has been screwing me over so much lately. It's been ridiculous. My mic has been fucking up. I really don't know what the problem has been. 
but I'm hoping that it's fixed. I'm hoping that it was just a sporadic thing and it just goes away, which happens a lot with Elgato. There's just shit that pops up and then goes away if you leave it for a while. So hoping that it does not fuck up. And if this video is up, first of all, anybody that is watching right now, go ahead and comment hashtag elite sub. That's how I know the hardcore subscribers. They go ahead and watch my watch my videos pretty much all the way through. Don't let Steven Jackson run all over you. You know what? It doesn't even fucking matter. It's the end of the third quarter. You want to run? Go ahead. You're down by three scores. Do it. I don't care. I don't care. I love it. No, that was dumb. Oh, yeah. Who was that? Dexter Fowler. Fucking A. I love these fucking low goals, really low coins, DNs. They're just fast. So good. Jadavion Clowney, Dexter Fowler. Amazing. Amazing. Run the ball, dude. I don't care. Do it. I know you want to. Just tackle him. That's it. That's fine. Bro, keep on running the ball. Do it. Nothing over the middle. You got nothing deep either. Please get the pick. Or just... Fu Jesus Christ, Brandon Browner. You just, like, squashed him. You, like, you smacked the ball out, like, punched him in the face, and then teabagged him. That's... See, that's that's how I know Brandon Brown is a true player. Come on, man. He's got nothing. I get the pick. Thank you, Mark Barron. Throw this shit away. Or, well, that was... I don't even know why I said that. Game over. It's over now. I can say this confidently. The game is now over. <laughs> Three minutes, 30 seconds, fourth quarter. It's done. I don't even care. It doesn't matter if he sacks me. It doesn't matter if he gets an interception. It doesn't even matter if he gets a pick six. Fucking fumble for six. Don't, don't matter. It's over. And Carlos Williams is going to go ahead and try his ass off anyway because I haven't given him the ball. And he's like, give me my goddamn reps. I, I heard him say that. Just so you know. This play is so good. Or it used to be. I'm hoping it is still because I'm going to try it. No! See? He got... Oh, wow. <laughs> It's Terrell Pryor. How do you fumble twice? How the fuck do you fumble twice? If he, Okay, guys, if you did not see it, go back and look at that play. Gary Barnage was so butt-booty naked open. It was absolutely fucking ridiculous. He was so open, and Terrell Pryor fumbles. Like, seriously? You fumble at that situation? I was just trying to run the clock out, and I was trying to get some yards so, I don't know, I could get a first down and really end it. But no, I, I just get fucked over as... I don't know his first name, but Tart, the guy from the Niners, completely shuts down that screenplay. <sighs> that, that's a bummer. Mm, no, sir. See, 6 for 18, 54 yards, 3 interceptions. The guy had one series, and it was just on defense where he was able to stop me. And it, his offense is terrible. That's the problem with him. got no wow no pick I, I guess I was standing too far forward oh shit <laughs> you're not getting the end zone oh my god I fucking I all out blitz thinking he was gonna run and he still didn't even get in the end zone Go ahead and toss it. Oh, wow, he didn't. Why? I just got pancaked. My guys just got fucking thrown to the ground. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, so on this kickoff, I'm going to make sure five seconds goes by so that there's no two-minute warning. I'm just going to run. In fact, I might just cut to the end of the game because there's really nothing else. Well, eh, maybe not. All right, Josh Cribs, can you get a kick return to... Uh, Seal off your MVP day. Nope, I didn't even 
I completely went away from what I was saying. I was trying to waste five seconds. I wasted four. That sucks. All right, Carlos Williams, do what you did earlier. Get a couple yards or more. Minute 58. He's still running his bitch blitzes. I really just want to fucking shut this shit down. I want to get, like, some huge-ass play. I'm getting so greedy. Oh, my God. I'm going to run a screenplay. I'm going to run a screenplay. I'm going to see if it works. Oh, fuck. Come on. Carlos Williams. Please. Please just all-out blitz me. He's got... Oh, my God. It's... Fucking linemen just run right past him. Seriously, every fucking time. It's ridiculous. Oh, my God. Minute 48. Third and 12. Fuck. I don't really want to throw here. All right. Oh, yeah. Gary Barnish for the first. That's going to end it. Fuck your blitzes, bitch. Alright. Minute 16. Yeah, this game's over. I can go ahead and run this shit out. Even if he calls all his timeouts, it doesn't matter. Nope. Nothing. If he doesn't call his timeouts... Okay, he does. Wow. Dude, the game's fucking over. Like, are you serious, dude? Fucking A. 35-21. The game is over, dude. Quit making us sit here even longer. Like, are you serious? Fuck. Just don't call... Oh, my God, dude. Quit making me fucking sit here. This game is over. I know nobody even made it this far in the video. And if you did, you're, you're a true MVP. So I'm not really worried about it, but still. It's still fucking annoying. Oh, did he just run over him for the first? No, he didn't, but I'm going to go for it, of course. Call your timeouts, dude. Just do it. I don't care. <sighs> Come on. Let's just get this first and end it. Yep, that's it. Oh! Damn, Carlos Williams. Ain't that serious, dude. Finally, this game is mercifully fucking over. That was a roller coaster ride. Holy shit. Really, dude? Are you fuck? Oh my god. Uh, you are the definition of butthurt. I just uh, tried to throw it because he fucking. He ran offside. It's a call timeouts. Fuck him. Alright, so I already know who my MVP is. It's pretty obvious. No, it's not Terrell Breyer. So I beat him everywhere except for rushing yards, which obviously he destroyed us in because he had Vincent Jackson, and I think he had one or two long runs. For the most part, I kept him down, or kept him contained. Let's go ahead and check the stats. So Terrell Breyer definitely had a good game. 50 for 22, 274, three TDs, no interceptions, but um, the problem with him was that he fumbled twice. So that was not good. But I think the obvious MVP is Josh Cribbs with three receptions, 420 yards, and two TDs when I was getting sacked right as we came out, 21 to 14, on third and forever. I threw a dot to him, and he ran it for a touchdown. So he pretty much saved my ass because I probably would have punted, and he quite possibly could have tied it, so it would have been a tie game, and I think he definitely saved the game for us. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to look out for the next one. Be sure to check out my Twitter. The link is in the description. Guys, get notifications every time I upload a video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, Dangerous Army, I'm out.